Yo, what is going on, Neat Gang? It's your boy, Comfy Neat, and um, welcome to the next episode of the Neat Ascension series. Um, I really don't have any good excuses as to why I haven't been uploading lately. Maybe that my last few videos put me in a bad headspace. But anyways, uh, today is all about positivity. And um, yeah, what I'm going to be doing this video uh, was inspired by, I guess, one of my idols. Um, he's a fighter in the UFC. I don't know if he's still competing. He apparently retired, but his name is Conor McGregor. And an interesting fact is that he actually used to be a neat or allegedly was one. And he basically spent all of his early 20s, I guess, practicing in the gym. And um, I feel like although he's had his moments where he's kind of embarrassed himself, I feel like overall he's a pretty inspiring person. And um, I think this was, I guess, what I'm about, what my, fucking hell. What I'm about to do was basically inspired by like a video I saw of him, um, essentially um, doing like positive self-talk. And I feel like I've seen this or um, heard this like mentioned in a lot of like self-improvement videos or I don't know, books or whatever. And I don't know, it might be like kind of a meme. It might be, uh, I don't know, kind of funny. But um, anyways, like, yeah, I'm probably going to do that um, in front of the bathroom mirror and film myself doing it. And the goal is to um, basically get in the habit of doing that every day, at least for five minutes, um, just talking to myself and being positive and saying good things to myself, doing all that affirmation crap. And we'll see how that works out. Hopefully, um, I get some return on investment. It's really only five minutes of my day, but um, yeah, anyways, yeah, let's head to the bathroom. Hey, so we're in the bathroom now, and um, <laughs> yeah, this kind of um, might be a dumb idea. Um, I don't know if you guys can see me well, but um, yeah, essentially I'm gonna be saying positive things to myself in the mirror, and um, I have no idea how this is gonna go. Um, never done this before, but yeah, um, I'm gonna definitely gonna give it a try. All right. Um, <laughs> um, shit. This is really bizarre. Um, wow, that's really interesting. I am actually finding it really difficult to say something nice to myself especially if I look to my own eyes and try to say something good to myself it's almost like my brain is subconsciously blocking me from doing it and it's like I'm just I'm almost anxious about it in a way, but I don't know why that is. Well, maybe I do, maybe I just hate myself, but fuck, okay. Um, hey, um, you got this? God, it's so fucking, ugh. Oh, it's weird. Um, like I can see why this is a, a skill or something you have to do a lot because I don't know I feel like I'm my own worst critic people are often their own worst enemy they often abuse themselves mentally and I think that's what I've been doing for the longest time so when I try and say something nice to myself the words just aren't coming out um, you got this um, I, uh, I believe in you, um, you're going to be getting hella bitches, <laughs> okay, it's stupid, um, yeah, yeah, you got this, uh, you might be down on your luck now, but, you know, telling you, you have it within you to become a successful person. Um, 
you know, you shouldn't be so hard on yourself, especially um, for how you were in the past and even how that influenced you now. You, you don't have any, you didn't have any idea at the time. And um, honestly, yes, so don't be so hard on yourself. Just uh, take life one day at a time and, you know, you're talented, I feel. You're talented, you certainly aren't lacking in that department. Um, and you know, once you put in the hard work, because you definitely have it within you to be a, a motivated, um, positive person, you've definitely shown signs of that. Um, you're pretty consistent with your exercise. And yeah, you know, keep this up, just keep at it. And you know, yeah, you're the man. Oh my God, it's so cringe. Oh, um, you're not going to sell yourself short. You're not going to, you know, pretend to be less than you think you are just because you want to, you know, appease people and think, you know, and make yourself feel, appear less intimidating to people. Like, why are you doing that? You are capable of so much and you know, all this lying to yourself, putting yourself down for other people, you know, it has to stop and it will stop because I know you're capable of doing that and that in reality, you're the man, you got this, you're fucking alpha, you're fucking, you're fucking Chad, and you know what, you know, fuck all the haters, all the bullshit, you know, all the people that ever doubted you, you know, from when you were young, they, they didn't know who you are deep inside, but, you know, I believe in you, you have every tool in your toolbox to succeed and you will succeed because you have drive, you have motivation. It just hasn't been there, but you know what? From now on, that's going to that's going to change and you're going to be motivated because you're capable of it and you know, I believe in you. You're the fucking man, you're an alpha and yeah, and whoo! Yeah. Um Oh, it's still kind of cringy. Um, yeah, no, fuck all that. Fuck all that. Um, you know what? You're certainly capable of achieving everything you put your mind to. And, you know, all the hesitation, um, all the hesitation um, that you've shown in the past, that's just because, you know, you haven't just practiced, you know, being confident, having resolve. But you know what? You're capable of that, and um, yeah, um, yeah. Just trying to shout like this, like it's obviously I'm running up against something inside me. Um, yeah, but yeah, you are a beast, and you are a tank. You will get massive at the gym. You'll be, you'll have a MMA fight physique. Within a few months, by the end of the year, you'll be made, you'll have, you know, I don't know, you know, fuck all that nine to five shit. You'll you'll be making six figures on YouTube, on the internet, you know, doing things you like. Um, you have it within you to do that, um, and you know, you have the talent. Just as long as you put in the hard work, which I know you're gonna do. Um, yeah, you have it within you, and. Um, yeah. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. 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 Okay. You know, fuck all this, like, you know, beta loser cuck shit. You know, you're a beast, and you know, yeah. Just keep at this. Keep at this. Keep practicing being confident. Um, keep yelling. You're just not used to expressing yourself like this yet. 
um, cause this part of you just has been locked up for so long, but yeah, you know, you fucking got this. Yeah, you got this. Woo! Fuck! Okay, sorry. Fuck, no, fuck being apologetic. You know, you're a fucking beast. You know, you shouldn't fucking apologize to anyone. You know, you're done being this fucking apologetic loser. You know, that's over now. Just speak your, speak your mind. Just speak your goddamn mind. And you know what? Yeah, this is fine. This is, this is fine. You know, we're all told not to express ourselves, at least in the culture I grew up in, you know, it's understandable the way you are growing up in some collectivist East Asian culture full of fucking betas and pussies, you know, telling you not to speak your mind, not to, you know, you know, I shouldn't be swearing so much because of demonetization, but, you know, yeah, screw that. Uh, well, I'll try not to swear as much, but yeah, you got this. Um, you're a beast. And you know, this just takes practice. This just takes practice. And you're gonna do this. You're gonna do this every morning, you know, hype yourself up and then go about your day, go about your day and just fucking kill it. Yeah, you're gonna kill it. You know, who cares if this is a fucking meme? We'll see if it works. I know, but I know it'll fucking work because it works for those who believe it works. That's really just the whole trick. That's really just the key to life and you've figured it out, you figured it out, and you're gonna be making six figures by the end of the year, seven figures in the next five years, and you know what? You're gonna spend your money wisely, and you're gonna invest that, you're gonna learn how to do, to do all that stuff, you're gonna manage your time, you're not gonna waste any more of it on useless things, only for the occasional necessary break, but otherwise, yeah, you're gonna kill it, you're gonna kill it. I know you I know you are capable of doing this and yeah. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Okay. Alright, I think that's enough. Yeah, I think that's enough. I shouldn't stop yelling because yeah, okay, maybe I should. Yeah. Alright, so now that that's over, um I just wanted to um I guess maybe talk about how that made me feel. And you know what, it felt good. I feel like if I did this every morning, it might maybe, you know, prime my mind, um, you know, get it, I don't know. I feel like it kind of puts me in a different state. Um, I guess I feel like I'm probably talking more confidently, uh, you know, more assertively than I was at the start of the video. I think I'm talking with my natural or more confident voice, which usually, um, you know, uses more of my upper registers and I feel like this is how I should be talking ideally but I feel like that's kind of beside the point. I feel like just doing that would help, you know, prime my mind, set it in the right direction, you know. And, you know, also, you know, people say that, um, you know, repeat a lie, repeat a lie often enough and you start to believe it. Well, it's kind of working on the same principle, except, you know what, it may or may not be, I really have no clue, but it's more about just reiterating the same, you know, positive, positive ideas over and over again until I believe them, I start to internalize them. Um, that is the logic behind doing this. Uh, again, okay, objectively speaking, I have no idea that this will work, but that's how it's supposed to work. So I guess you'll see in the coming few months how that turns out if I start to be more productive. And um, yeah, so that's basically what Conor McGregor supposedly does every morning, um, except he does it even more convincingly. He's even more hyped up. He, he's even more happy looking when he talks to himself. And you know, I really want to get to that point where I'm you know, not so ashamed of myself, um, not afraid to say what I really want or really feel. And, you know, yeah, I feel like this might be one 
step on the journey towards that goal. And aside from this, at some point in the, in the near future, I'm going to be um, making like a, a sort of like routine or schedule on like a Google Doc or something. And, you know, sharing a link and uh, posting it so you guys, I guess, can see me keeping track of myself. And uh, I guess the various like hobbies or goals or things that I'm going to be working on, like, for example, I'm mean, like coming up with a routine uh, off camera because I, I tried doing that with screen capture. And it was just really boring. But yeah, I'm going to be sharing that and you guys can see like my current goals. And yeah, anyways, I think that's all for now. Uh, this is Comfy Neat signing out. Hope you enjoy the video and hopefully I keep up with this. Yeah.